support a black woman. This is a black woman's book. And I like the pictures. <laughs> back to my channel i'm kimar for those that are new and today's video is my quarantine haul but it's the part two so i don't know if y'all remember but in the first one i was talking about how i bought a lot of stuff that hadn't came yet or hadn't come yet i don't know i bought a lot of stuff that didn't arrive yet so yeah that stuff all arrived like over a month ago but i was in classes and i had a lot of work to do so i didn't have time to record or you know deal with all that but now i do because classes are over so we're gonna finish this haul out. So the first set of stuff that I got is from Bath and Body Works. I got three of these little card things and then I got, and I got six wallflowers. I used one of the wallflowers, but the one that I have left, this one is perfect something. I don't know what that says. Y'all see it. That's one that I have left. And then I have fresh cut lilacs left. I haven't used that and strawberry pound cake i'm excited for that one um so the ones that i have used already then are i think honeysuckle and freesia 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 that's the one i use that's the green one that one smelled really good but i used it all and i think right now i'm using cucumber veranda which i'll show y'all insert a clip of it in the wall but yeah i love wallflowers the smell just isn't that strong so i usually put wallflowers like throughout other parts of my apartment so like in the living area the kitchen stuff like that because the smell just isn't strong enough for my room so yeah but if i had an outlet in my closet i'll put them in my closet so that's some stuff i got from bath and body works and i also got the little um like i said the little car fresheners this one is in strawberry pound cake and this one is in black cherry Mer merlot um, and I'll show y'all the visor clip and then the other one that I have in my car is just in my car right now. So I'll insert a clip of that so y'all can see that. And the one in my car right now smells so good. It's like the best car freshener I've ever had. So I might be permanently switching to Bath and Body Works for car freshener. I like the one I'm bending down. I might be permanently switching to Bath and Body Works for car fresheners though because they're just really fragrant and it's like the smell lasts a long time it doesn't wear out and it just smells really good and the little visor clip is really really cute in my car once I get my car cleaned it's gonna be just such a vibe in there that's all from Bath and Body Works and in total I spent fifty twenty one. I bought this stuff a while ago like two months ago um the wallflowers were 480 a piece the um the car fresheners were three dollars a piece and then the visor clip was 750 so yeah fifty dollars and 21 cent at bath and body works the next thing that i got were these essential oils it's called diary of essential oils by i don't know how you pronounce that but i love this little case that came in i used every single one of these every single one but they lasted me honestly longer than i thought they would the bottles are really little i'm gonna show y'all another another essential oil so y'all can have like a comparison like th this bottle is much bigger than these but the bottles are really little but they had a lot of fragrances that normally don't come in essential oils so it also came with um this one came with droppers and the little thing to pull the to pull the dropper out like the pull it came with the little you know those are called droppers right and then you know the little thing that comes inside of the essential oil that's like keeping it from just being open this is to pull those out I think or that's what I use it for so yeah and then I don't even know what this is but I have it so yeah that's why I keep this little case and then if I ever get some little essential oils again I can just put them into there um, and this one came with lemon peppermint eucalyptus lavender geranium sandalwood bergamot clary sage tea tree um rose and that's it so yeah some good some good smells some good vibes the next thing that i got was this schmidt's rose and vanilla natural deodorant um i don't know how i feel about this deodorant i'm trying to switch to natural deodorants because you know just trying to do better but this i think it's irritating my underarms because my underarms feel so dry and irritated all the time and this is the only thing new so I don't know i'm trying to moisturize my underarm skin more because i don't understand why something natural would be irritating them but it is i don't want to be like buy it 
and then you get it and your underarms be irritated like mine so maybe i'll update y'all and see if it's the it's the deodorant or something else but i'm kind of thinking about just buying another deodorant another natural deodorant but another brand because i don't think this is working for me it says it absorbs wetness i guess you don't want i guess deodorant is supposed to make your arms underarms dry but it's making them too dry too dry for my liking so the next thing that i got was this cleganic essential oils this is 100 pure and natural essential oils this one comes with this set comes with the top eight so it comes with um, peppermint, lavender, eucalyptus, tea tree, lemongrass, rosemary, frankincense, and or organic orange oil. So yeah, these are the ones, the bottles that are a little bigger, which I need because y'all know I go through essential oils, so I need kind of bigger bottles. But I do like that little case with the small bottles, so I'm conflicted. But whenever these get low, I'm gonna order some more and show y'all them. I'm just gonna try a bunch of different brands until I feel like I found one that I really like. I always like to try different smells. So that's why I always switch brands so I can get something different with everyone. The next thing that I got was this Travelish coloring book. This is an adult coloring book for stress relief and travel inspiration. Um, so yeah, I got this book. I color, I try to color almost every day, but some, some days I miss. But yeah, it's a few of my coloring. This was on Amazon. Links to everything will be below. But yeah, support a black woman. This is a black woman's book. And I like the pictures. As y'all can see, I'll be coloring it up. So yeah, I definitely, I've been thinking like, is she gonna make a part two? Because what am I gonna do when I'm done with this one? I don't, I don't know. So please suggest some adult coloring books if you have some suggestions. And then last but not least, the wax warmer finally came, the plug-in wax warmer. It has wax all over the front because I was trying to pull it out the wall while the wax was still hot and that's not smart. I should have just waited till it was hard like this and then I could just take this the bottom of an inset and then it'll just pop out clean. But yeah, it's really cute. I'll show y'all it in the wall or whatever, but this has been a great addition to my room. It's just cute to have lit up in the corner. It's a very strong aroma. Like my whole room will smell like whatever wax is in there. So yeah, I really love that. Oh wait, that's not it. That's actually not it. The last thing that I got was these vines. I don't know if y'all see these vines around my room. I'll just kind of slowly pan the camera. All these vines. Ugh, I can't get the others out, but yeah. I have them all around my room. I got those off Amazon. I don't remember the exact vendor. I don't remember the price. All of that will be below or on the screen or something. But they were supposed to come like one long vine and then like hang down. But when I tried to unravel it, they all just came apart. So I had to change the plan and just put them all over my room, which actually I like. So I'm not even mad about it. I thought I was like, at first I was kind of annoyed that it all came apart because I saw what it was supposed to be, but it's really cute. It's a really cute accent around my room. So yeah, I like it. So yeah, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just encourage everyone to give somebody a compliment today or something. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will definitely see you guys in the next video.